And you have a little monkey in their eye because they think you're challenging them. And they'll beat your ass. <laughs> So a monkey jumped on a lady back there, American lady, and she had her backpack on her and the monkey was basically robbing her ass. <laughs> What's good fam, welcome to the Sacred Monkey Forest. We're in Ubud at the moment, we just went for a drive from Changu and still busy in Ubud. But there was uh, gaps of nice rice paddies and rice fields and open spaces, which is really nice. But we got into Ubud and there's a lot of hotels, a lot of traffic. But here seems nice and tranquil, so we're going to go have a look at these monkeys. It was actually the kids who booked who wanted to do this one, because monkeys are meh. I don't really care about monkeys, but they may be cute and fluffy, but they try to steal your shit, so we got to be careful. But this looks like a beautiful place, so let's go have a look. The sacred monkey forest sanctuary in Ubud, Bali is a magical place where ancient spirituality meets playful primate antics. Nestled within a lush tropical rainforest, this enchanting sanctuary is home to over 700 long-tailed macaques. As you wander through the serene temple grounds, you'll encounter these mischievous monkeys swinging from trees, exploring ancient stone statues, and occasionally engaging in a comical game of chase. It's a unique and immersive experience that lets you connect with nature and Balinese culture, all while making some very new friends. Just remember to keep your belongings secure as these cheeky monkeys are known for their light-fingered skills. So we're just looking at the rules and the guidelines for dealing with the monkeys. Like you should never look a monkey in the eye because they think you're challenging them. And they'll beat your ass. <laughs> and they'll steal all your stuff basically, which we already knew. So yeah, we're pretty prepared. Let's go. So it's 10,000 rupiah uh, a ticket, which is basically about 10 bucks New Zealand which is more than affordable and definitely worth it. This place is beautiful, amazing. Gonna scan that. That scan. I don't think that was even working. It's like a couldn't beep or nothing, man. Like there's a road that actually runs underneath this place as well which is really cool so it's still used for access this place is beautiful i'm super happy that we actually came here because i wasn't expecting this like wow this is beautiful they've done such a good job the platforms are really nice um it's not even that hot here like bali's pretty mild to be honest as we started walking around, you could notice the monkeys checking out the tourists and they definitely know if you have food or drinks in your bag, so don't bring their stuff here. That's a big boy. These guys in the green were keeping an eye on things just to make sure the monkeys and the tourists kept their distance from each other. Battle Royale is going on over there. Monkey on monkey. Brutal. Brutal. But look at this place man, this place is beautiful. I think a monkey just threw a stick at me. <laughs> Bounced off my face. Yeah, so besides the monkeys, they've done an awesome job, like I said before. Heaps of stuff to see, they've got some beautiful temples here, lots of attractions, heaps of uh, walk good signage postings, it's really well done. Lots of lookouts as well, and beautiful jungle. Definitely recommend coming to this place. Even if you don't like hairy monkeys stealing all your goods. Awesome place, it's not too busy. Definitely a touristy spot, obviously, but beautiful. This temple, this main temple is beautiful as well. I'm gonna get some shots of that too. And yeah, man, good first stop.
left. Oh, my shit. <laughs> Why is it banging? It just cut me off. <laughs> just stay out of the way. Around the uh, yeah. Oh, hang on. Wait. So this spot here was a little dangerous due to the monkey's food source being right next to the path where the tourists were walking yep. and there were the actually list. no green staff around to manage any interactions. And as you'll see later, this is where things popped off. So we've been walking through and we found it's actually a cage with some monkeys in there. I don't know why they'd be caged. We're thinking maybe they're poo chuckers. Trying to save us from the poo chucking, but let's check them out. Yeah, they're the injured ones. One's blind. Oh, he's blind. These are our special monkeys. So one of them is old and uh, unfortunately he's blind. And another female, they had to amputate an arm and a leg uh, as well. So we are being looked after in this cage, which is a bit of a bummer. Since you've got this amazing forest around here. Um, but obviously for their safety and well-being, Still sad to see when you got all this space here. I mean, what happens in the wild if a monkey goes blind? I'm pretty sure the rest of the monkeys look after that monkey. I don't know, but you'd think so. On the ground, on the ground, something. Okay. And your sunglasses also. Thank you, thank you. Come on, buddy. That's everything. Okay. Thank You're you. Good? That's okay. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, that scared me. It's alright. The missus yeah, will say. Okay. <laughs> so a monkey jumped on a lady back there, American lady. And she had a backpack on her and the monkey was basically robbing her ass. <laughs> was was on her head, holding her head while it's gone into her backpack and taking all her things and poor girl didn't know what to do. So Nalini, being the saviour, <laughs> just walked over and started clapping around in the monkey's face. And then the monkey grabbed Nalini's dress thingy and she just bit that off him and saved that poor lady's life. <laughs> she had no idea what to do. I actually got the whole thing on camera, but I'm not going to show it, you get the gist of it. It's pretty simple, we're visitors in their house, so follow the rules, respect the animals, respect the natural environment, you're in a privileged position to have an amazing experience, so make the most of it, and maybe you'll leave with everything you came with, plus some beautiful memories to go with it. Selfie time. Monkey selfie? Nah, bro. <laughs> no monkey selfies for us, man. If the monkey jumps on you, all good. But if not, leave that damn monkey alone. Alright, fam, and we are back at the beginning. It's getting very humid. Packed up. It's getting much busier now. So glad we got here early. Love that place. That place was amazing. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I just walked up a hill one time. So worth the money. Um, definitely come see this place. I think I'll wrap up here. We're off to a few more places, but it's probably long enough for one video. Um, so if you liked it, hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys at the next stop in the next video. Later. So welcome to the Monkey Amphitheater. I don't actually know if this is a Monkey Amphitheater, but it's an amphitheater. But the dude just started drilling something, so. Oh, pass. He just killed it. He just killed it. 